Hello everyone, and welcome to Le Cordon Bleu Room. That's right, this is Little Folk's very own cooking school, and today we have a delicious recipe. We are making Navajo bread. It's a very simple recipe that you can probably make with ingredients that you've got lying around in your house. So let's get started. So the first step as always, is wash your hands, make sure you use soap, You can sing a song to yourself, whatever you want, but make sure you get a good 20 seconds of hand washing. Next, you're going to take out a large bowl. We're going to use this to mix our dry ingredients. First, you're going to start with two cups of flour. You're also going to add one tablespoon of baking powder and one teaspoon of salt. Next, you're going to add the water. You want to use about one to one and a quarter cups. And you're going to pour it in slowly because you don't want to add too much, lest it get too liquidy. And then you can just mix it up. You want the dough to feel kind of like a pizza dough. So you can just keep mixing and knead it with your hands. This part's a little bit fun. The dough might stick to your hands and that's okay. Just don't lick it up. Once you have the dough ready, you're going to set it aside for about 30 to 60 minutes. Meanwhile, you want to cover a clean surface with flour to get ready for the dough. When the dough is ready, you can break off some pieces and start flattening them out on the surface. You want to make sure you cover both sides of the dough and flour so that it doesn't stick and try to flatten it out to about the thickness of a tortilla, so that way the whole thing will cook without burning. This recipe should make between 6 and 8 pieces of bread. Next you're going to warm up a pan on about medium heat. I recommend using a non-stick pan or a griddle or some kind of non-stick spray. And what you're going to do is just take the dough and place it on the pan and it's going to cook and once you start to see golden brown spots on one side you can flip it over until it's done. It'll probably take about three or four minutes. Let's try it and see how it is. Mm. It's hot. And of course, we always gotta give it a thumbs up. Very well. If you decide to make your own Navajo bread, feel free to email us a picture and tell us how it is.